In just a moment, your rep is going to perform the water hardness test. This test will give you an accurate measure of how hard your water is. That's important because water hardness can affect many things around your house. It can cause your water heater to wear out. It clogs the ice machine. It can damage your appliances pretty quickly. Even if your water's only moderately hard, you can wind up fighting continuous problems like bathtub scum, spots and streaks on glasses, stains in the toilet bowl. Hard water is caused by minerals in the water such as calcium, magnesium, and lime. The more minerals you have, the harder your water is and the more prevalent problems are. What most people don't realize is that they are already treating their water one box at a time and over the years have spent thousands of dollars buying chemical water softeners. Just about every cleaning product on the market today contains chemical water softeners. That's because in order to clean with water effectively, you must find a way to deal with water hardness. Most of us do that through chemical means. Let me show you what I mean. Here, look at this box of Cascade. It says right here, use more for hard water. Now why do you suppose that is? It's because Cascade contains complex sodium phosphates used in cleaning products because of their superiority in water softening, which minimizes the negative effects of water hardness. In other words, Cascade is simply a box of chemical water softener. Now, if we look at a container of laundry detergent, you'll also notice that the box lists water softeners as a main ingredient. As you can see, most common household cleaning products are simply designed to fight hard water. In order to clean with water, it must be treated. What your representative is about to show you is an alternative method of treating your water. Your rep will condition your water by using filtered water. Treated water isn't magic. It simply returns the water to the way it was meant to be, clean. Everything you're about to see during the presentation works because we're going to clean the water. Water is the universal solvent. The cleaner the water, the better the results. So in order to clean with water, it must be treated. The fact is, most common household cleaning products are simply designed to fight the negative effects of hard water. Treated water simply has a better ability to dissolve, whereas hard water has a limited ability to dissolve. For instance, think about your water as a magnet. It picks up everything it comes into contact with, just like a magnet going over a bunch of paper clips. The first time it goes over, it can pick up quite a few. The next time it goes over, it picks up fewer and the next time, even less. It's the same thing with water. If you could wipe the magnet clean, which is what we'll do to your water, it restores the power, power to clean. There are two ways to treat your water. You can treat it with chemicals, one box at a time, like you've been doing, or you can treat your water by filtration, which is similar to wiping the magnet clean. The hard water test will give you an accurate measure of how hard your water is. Now keep in mind, any result over three grains hard is considered hard enough to cause problems. Any water over 10 grains hard is very hard water and will cause bigger problems. Now, let's see your results.